Get a little cinematic of the cat's lair taking off. Oh, that looks cool. Oh, my landing gear going up. We're taking off into space. That's a big honking ship. All right, guys. So welcome back. <laughs> I know it's this is weird, but we're we're doing just a little Starfield tour of a ship I made. Um, I tried to resemble it off of the Cat's Lair and Thundercats. Jawa gave me the idea today. I just want to kind of bring up different pictures. Uh, that's not it. That's that's a pretty good one. Um, it, it it's a spaceship. So. Let's uh, pull that guy away and let's check it out in Starfield. So there'll be some pictures accompanying this, but look at these gigantic weapons up here. Uh, wow. Uh, those things are going to be vicious in a fight. This is kind of looking straight on. Let's go all the way back here. Not bad. Um, Not a lot of gravity there. Okay, it has a bunch of landing gear. There's my companion. And so this is the cat's lair from the outside. I don't know if you played Starfield yet, but it's pretty good. I need they'll probably should shore up some things. I put some covers and cowlings on there. All of the cargo in here is shielded cargo. Some big honking engines here. Um Lots of stuff going on in here. I got science area, an engineering area, habs, a captain's quarters. There's uh that's fuel up there. Uh, those are more fuel right there. Um, landing gears, VTOL type of landing gear. So there's some weapons right up here. It's like a particle cannon. That's the one up front is kind of like a laser cannon. And those are, that is a missile launcher, and that's another par uh, particle cannon. So you do have a budget with what you can work with here. And so there we go. That is the cat's lair. Uh, let's, let's go inside. Some thrusting panel things over there. And I think it's pretty interesting. So when you get here, when you play this game, you'll notice that uh, in Frontier, which is kind of your starter ship, you immediately go up to get into the cockpit. Not in this ship. This ship's a little different. So we're going to go ahead and board. Uh, first area here. Uh, I believe this is a three by engineering bay type of deal, which just kind of reminds me of a Carrick and a subdeck a little bit. Uh, there's no real consoles to interact with here. But there are some doors. Let's go back in this door here. Over here is okay. Pharmaceutical lab. So kind of research stuff. My my actual research lab. So this is kind of the science module, if you will. Some lockers and stuff there. Um, coming back into engineering. It's weird. I don't choose how it's connected, so it just kind of is what it is. But we can get to the other module going that way. It's weird that I can't just go up. They're kind of like some Star Citizen ships. There's no place to go up. So to get actually up to the cockpit here, I have to go through this door to the left. And that's probably going to be going up. Yep. Uh, we do have another door that goes forward. In here is some crew uh, living space. This is one of the habs. Uh, there's a bathroom. This is actually in the paw, in the right paw, the starboard paw of the cat's lair here. Um, so that's crew hab and then going backwards before we go up. This is kind of my industrial area, industrial workbench and the research lab, a spacesuit workbench over there, and then a weapon workbench. So lots of stuff to do here. And there are some portholes kind of all over the place. 
I tried to put them everywhere I could so that, so, you know, we, we could have views out of things, but obviously they didn't end up. Oh, there's one right there. The darkness of space. So let's go up a level. And instead of using our jetpack, we'll just climb up. Okay, and you can just fall down those as well. So coming up here and heading aft on the starboard side, notice there's another ladder and that takes you up to the cockpit. This would be the infirmary section, so med bay, a pharmaceutical lab and a research lab, and nothing to go back. There's, two, there's, there's that other ladder going up. Let's go ahead and take this door, midships. And right here, that's that's one of the portholes. Uh, nice view there. Um, this is like we uh, armory. This is the armory, like weapons area. I don't have anything in my cases. Uh, this is a storeroom, I think, with some weapons racks or maybe just a continuation of the armory. <laughs> Let's go through this door. There's no rhyme or reason of how these are connected. It's just kind of how the game is. Um, this is like a computer area. Where does, where does that go? I don't remember seeing that. Let's just jump down there. Okay, this is a storeroom for sure. Is this, that's the only way to get here? That's really weird. Another crew area, another, uh, like cooking area over here. Um, the galley and you can you can cook in this game too it's part of the crafting so more crew space crew hab uh, use my jetpack to go up that's really weird connection I don't know if I can change that or fix that or even if it's necessarily broken I don't know so we're gonna go rear to go up And you can just pull up there. Okay, this is... What room is this? Uh, I guess just a transit area. So this is another control station area over here. And there's a nice little porthole we can see out of on the starboard side, I believe. And you saw there's another floor up there, but we're going to go port. So this is kind of a crew commons area over here. I, I just kind of put stuff wherever. And we're looking midships. This is that where the Thundercats logo would be right here. Look it out. And coming to the rear. Another door here. This is a computer, a storage area or something. There's some, some jump seats. And another ladder going up. And there's the port side window. Uh, this is definitely the computer uh, section. I don't know what that goes up to uh, another storage area okay with another porthole and this one doesn't lead anywhere but you have another porthole up so this is kind of a just a storage area we will go backwards <laughs> midships again we'll come over here and we will go up I'm trying to remember what I what where I put everything Apparently, I just knocked all that stuff over. Uh, a porthole on the starboard side at the top. We'll open this door. And this is the captain's quarters, guys. Uh, of course, it's going to be right in front of my cockpit here. This is actually the docking port right here, right behind the bridge. I wanted to make that easy. And part of the, you know, the captain's area here. The captain's bed. Uh, captain's head. Um, I guess he, they have a TV, doesn't have to be a he, and you can navigate from right there as well. Then we'll go ahead and end it to the cockpit. This cockpit does have three seats, um, and I kind of like this one because it has pretty good views here. So we'll go ahead and enter the pilot seat. Oh yeah. All right, we're gonna go ahead and take off from my little base here. Get a little cinematic of the cat's lair taking off. Ooh, that looks cool. 
Oh, my landing gear going up. We're taking off into space. That's a big honking ship. It's not going to be fast. It actually does have quite a bit of cargo, though. It's surprisingly nimble moving it around here. Um, let me get my speed up. So my top speed right here is about 64 ish. And let me check my boost speed. Two twenty seven. So not real fast. Um, I guess I could put more engines on it, but yeah, I'm not going to, at least not right now. So I'm going to reduce my speed and we'll check out what the ship looks like. The outer space. Oh, throttle up a little bit. So I have one, two, three, four big engines and then two smaller engines over there. Um, can I look around here? Oh, I don't think I can just... Oh, there we go. So there's the cast layer from space with another ship floating out there. All the landing gear up. Very flat underneath, right? Like, like the cast layer would be. I think it looks pretty darn cool. Thunder. Thunder. Thundercats. Ho! I think we should go find uh, someone to fight. What do you guys think? Let me shoot some weapons off. So these weapons are of the front weapons. Hard to see them. And then my particle cannons are over there. And then I do have missiles. So that's it for the whole salvo until they recharge. So that's the full salvo. Oh yeah. And then going into first person here. Damn, my missiles recharge. That took a minute. I really want to get into like a dog fight. Let's see if I can find a fight. So just hang on a sec and we'll see what we can do. So, sorry about the delay, guys. Uh, actually, it's probably nothing for you. It's been a minute for me. I ended up having to go to one of my settlements uh, here on Earth. Yeah, this is what happened to Earth. Spoiler. Not that big of a spoiler. If you, if you followed the development of the game at all, Earth is not a habitable place anymore. This is actually uh, Colorado, where I'm from. This is the wasteland. All of Earth kind of looks like this. Please disregard. So I'm going to go straight up to, uh, to the cockpit, because you can do that instead of going through all the ship. I had to take a mission, so. Yeah, I went to numerous planets uh, and moons and couldn't find anybody who wanted to fight me. So I wouldn't want to fight me either. So uh, I did take a mission. Earth's got a lot of space debris. So let's find that guy. Set a course. And we're going to jump. Maybe I didn't go to the right place. There we go. It's only one ship, but... So he's targeted me, not doing much. Let's shoot some missiles at him. We can target subsystems, guys, uh, once we lock onto them. Oh, that didn't take much to take your shields down. 
Let's get a target lock. We're gonna take out his engines. Might need to maneuver and get behind him. Yeah, we're gonna have to get behind him. Shoot some missiles at his engines. Can we dock? Not yet. All right, now we can dock. So we're gonna dock with him while he's still shooting at us. Oh, that's annoying. And we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna. There's a reason I put the docking collar behind the cockpit. All right, let's bring out the gun. All right, there's our docking collar. We're gonna board that ship. This is kind of how you pirate other ships. So we're actually in his ship now. His alarm's going off. We're gonna. Their hatch. I don't see anybody right away. Oh, I don't want to go down there yet. See anybody there? My companion's going to give away everything anyway. Yep, there's a guy. Oh, I took all them off. There's a couple more left in there. But there's no sense in hiding now. Oh. Couple shots for good measure. There's a couple more in here. Where they're at, I don't know. But we can go, you know, we can loot these guys if we wanted to. I didn't see another door here. Where's the cockpit? Docking. I'm not sure where everybody else is. Cat's lair is up there. Oh, they're down here. It's a weird ship design. Randomized. My good old pistol. All right, and there we go. I took them out. And if we wanted to, we could actually go into their cockpit and take their ship. Then we could take it down to a planet, register it. Um, okay. Any may access. Oh God, Sarah, come on, get out of there. Ladder taker. Come on. Come on. Uh -huh. Alright. Someone else taking the ladder. And we'll go ahead and get in our cockpit. Time to move on. So, hope you guys like that. Like to that one. We're gonna undock. Are they still shooting at me? Well, they won't be for very long. So I could have taken their ship, but I don't really want their ship. They are still shooting at me. We will, we will run into them apparently. Ooh, see a sucker. Take them out. They have a little bit of cargo right there. So we'll take. Oh God. Okay, there we go. We'll take their plutonium. And yeah, there we go. So I hope 
you guys thought that was pretty cool. The cat's lair, uh, an interesting ship. That is for sure. <laughs> we'll see you guys in, uh, the next video, I guess. Uh, I hope, uh, I hope there's some coming out soon. Uh, we'll, we'll definitely see. Take care, guys.